A beloved Central Coast artist known for his vibrant contemporary paintings has died. KSBY News reporter Dustin Kleeman joins us from downtown San Luis Obispo outside the John Landon Gallery with more on the man's legacy. Dustin. Good evening, Richard Landon. His artwork, he left an imprint on the art world, but it was his personality that was even brighter. Diagnosed a genius at 11, John Landon would go on to work as an environmental engineer, but he was an artist his entire life. And in the early 90s, his style of California expressionism became noticed. And he really took off. He, his work really started being wanted and, you know, uh, purchased. And he started getting a lot of notoriety with um, a lot of the elites down in L.A. Most movie stars have his work. The whimsical and vibrant pieces decorated the Central Coast. For artist Charlie Klingman, Landon's work was immediately recognizable. I'd say it's brilliant how he can simplify his subject. That's a hard thing to do, to simplify it and make it look fun. Landon was known just as much by his warm personality and conversation as he was his art. He loved people. He would meet somebody and uh, instantly kind of make friends. He was very uh, gregarious and very good with drawing somebody in. He was kind of the life of the party everywhere he went. Two weeks ago, Landon was in a crash and suffered significant injuries. On Wednesday, he passed away. He was 68. But John Landon's art and legacy will live on. It just, it'll never go away. Like, it's, it's there. It's part of the Central Coast. The style is solid, um, nothing like it. And uh, he's a nice guy, so it's kind of uh, parallel with the artwork. The light is on in his gallery tonight. People have been walking by and checking out his pieces. Uh, we also spoke to one of his friends who found out about the news uh, and just spoke about his personality and the jokes that they would have back and forth. He was most recently up in the Northwest painting in Portland, giving his bright and eccentric painting style to that area as well. Live and local in San Luis Obispo, I'm Dustin Kleeman, KSPY News. All right, Dustin, thank you. Most recently, Landon spent time in Portland, uh, as Dustin was just talking about, and he was painting the Northwest scene with his unique style. Uh, and uh, his son, Sean, says his father even had a piece hanging in the White House during President George W. Bush's administration.